All right, so talk about something. You're just, this is just testing right now. Yeah. <laughs> I looked through your patches. Yeah. <laughs> I did not realize you had this many. Yeah, I've got a lot of patches. I collect them. So some of you might recognize the room that I'm in as I've filmed videos in this room before, but essentially it's just my dining room. And I have a couple more talking head videos, I guess, that I'm gonna be filming uh, soon because it's getting to winter and there's a lot of stuff that I wanna share, but there's just a little less flying. Uh, plus a bunch of changes have been happening around um, in, I guess, in my aviation career and just um, with my airplane. So I wanna make a little bit better a uh, more aesthetically pleasing space to film in. So I'm gonna take one of the rooms in my house and make it a semi-studio, I guess. So I don't know anything really about making a studio, but um, I guess whatever I can do will be better than what I have now. But pretty much this is the room that I have to work with. And you can see that it is just full of stuff. What I'm really just gonna be doing is taking all the stuff that I have from around my house that's aviation related, trying to make a background, set up some lights, and make an aviation themed studio. So let's see how it goes. So one of the things that I have to think about when trying to make a studio or something is lighting. That's obviously one of the, the, the biggest things. So I really don't have too much in the way of lighting here, but I do have a window there and a window there. So I think my best option for putting up the studios in this corner here. And so I'm gonna clean some of the stuff out and get that corner all ready to go. Maybe put some other stuff in the, in the attic for storage. And then, yeah, we'll see how it goes. So as I was cleaning stuff out, I actually came across a box with some of my old stuff in it. And in that I found this, which is a clock that I made in a manufacturing class, I think in high school. And so you can kind of see how long I've been into airplanes for, for, a, for a while now. So uh, I might actually be able to use this in you know, some background pieces. So I'm, I'm gonna keep it out and see what happens. All right, so I've cleaned everything out as you can see. Well, most everything at least. And I've moved the couch to the other side because well, I don't really know how to set this up <laughs> very well, but I'm gonna put the couch, uh, I have the couch, so I'm gonna use it and I've got the table there so I'm gonna use that and now I'm gonna go throughout my house and try to find certain some things to put as props I think I actually do have an actual prop <laughs> to put in the background make it a little bit more aviation themed all right let's see <laughs> it's an oil tank <laughs> that holds a lot of oil I think it's like nine gallons. Wow. All right, so I've basically been working all day on this thing. Uh, obviously with some help, of course. Thanks, Monica. Nope, I don't think she heard. But I've gotten pretty much the basics of what I want. It's not 100% perfect, but I went around to the house and took a bunch of the aviation related things around my house and put them in one corner. I am not an interior designer. This is a, uh, I feel absolutely out of my element in this. Ah. It will look better when there's stuff on the wall. I think there's just too much open space. Let's do it. Let's pick what we want to put on the wall. Much better. Hmm. Uh, perhaps? That's a good one. All right, so that's pretty much it. I think I've got a new studio. 
What do you think? It looks great. <laughs> it's not 100% done. Honestly, I'd really, I'd really like to um, take that patch book and make it a patch wall, but I don't have the kind of resources right now, so I'm just gonna go with that for now. And uh, other than that, maybe put a cover on the couch, make it not look as ridiculous, I guess. Upgrade the lighting just a little bit, make it not as harsh, but yeah, I think that's what I can do with the resources that I have now. I think uh, the only last thing I have to do is just place the camera. So I think, uh, what do you think, about there? Yeah, I think that works. Looks good. Here's the new setup for the next videos I'm gonna be shooting in the upcoming days. I mean, I've got a lot of stuff coming your way. I've got a video on <laughs> some issues I ran into with the FAA a couple years back. I've got uh, maybe perhaps a new airplane. <laughs> the smoke oil tank might have already given it away, or if you follow me on Instagram, you probably already know. But yeah, it's got some a lot of new stuff coming your way. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and like this video if you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see ya.